All right, you're watching Weather AM here on the Weather Network. I'm meteorologist Chris Murphy, and it is Wednesday, February 21st. Nothing like a time lapse of some tobogganing uh, down Citadel Hill in beautiful Halifax, Nova Scotia, where we have had ourselves a very snowy February. 132 centimeters of snow is reported at Stanfield. So today we got a break. It's cold and crisp and clear across most of eastern Canada, Atlantic Canada. Uh, temperatures warming up, shedding layers in Ontario and Quebec. Look at that, double digits in Windsor, 8 degrees in Toronto. So a little spring in your step, a little more cloud cover than yesterday. Uh, we take a look, we've got high pressure across the east coast and this weak system here moving across Ontario and Quebec will bring a little bit of rain snow showers uh, Wednesday evening over towards Georgian Bay through the Saguenay region. Uh, Ottawa could be looking at a bit of snow for you on Thursday morning. Now that quickly moves off towards the south and then uh, cloud cover, it's still very mild in southern Ontario on Thursday, some light snow in the north. Got to focus here on the east. Now this first system coming in will scrape Nova Scotia with some light snow. Halifax and eastwards, but it's the freezing rain potential for eastern Newfoundland we're more concerned about. You can get several hours of that before changing to rain. Then a second system comes in, and this one will drop your temperatures Friday night in southern Ontario into Quebec and bring not needed rain, and it could be heavy for you to New Brun no uh, Nova Scotia and PEI. I mean, these are areas with massive snow banks. So first the snow, and this will be um, mainly Friday for you into central Newfoundland, 10 to 20 centimeters lesser amounts in the southeast because of the freezing rain risk lesser amounts in Nova Scotia and PEI because of the rainfall threat so that could be a few hours of freezing rain and that could knock the power out and make things very dicey before the rain shows up Sydney Nova Scotia the land of the massive snowbanks looks like some five to ten centimeters of snow Thursday Friday warming up Saturday heavy rain and a freeze up come Sunday so this is not going to be a good forecast for you let's go to Wawa Ontario and uh, this is from this morning and uh, we can see that the lake has uh, got some good co ice coverage on there. Uh, Wawa today about plus two degrees going to be uh, dropping your temperatures come Friday. Look at Friday's temperatures in the north much colder. Southern Ontario still pretty mild Friday not as warm as today or tomorrow and then by Friday night you are in that cold. This is not even including wind chills into Quebec. A little bit of rain snow showers for you on Friday with temperatures above the freezing mark and by Saturday minus double digits but it's a short-lived cold Cold. Look at Ottawa, big plunge Saturday, and then next week you're back up warm enough for rain showers. Speaking of warm, it has been a very warm February in Winnipeg, and yesterday, once again, above the seasonal mark. You've only had one day below seasonal, one day at seasonal, and today normal is minus seven, so you're above that again today. The cold air is up towards Hudson Bay, western Nunavut. Sunshine abounds with milder weather into Saskatchewan and Alberta and into the BC coast. We've got some light snow showers, uh, rain showers, pardon me. But look what looms. A lobe of the polar vortex will be coming back. So don't put away the winter gear just yet. Winnipeg, what a Celsius seesaw this is from minus 8 Friday to plus 8 Saturday, from plus 10 Monday to minus 9 on Tuesday.